From Kylie Jenner refusing to let anybody body shame her after giving birth, to Kim Kardashian coming up with the savagest comebacks for all the mom shamers, let's look at the times the Kardashians have clapped back at fans. And right off the bat, it's Kourtney being criticized for having food in her bathroom. Back in March 2023, the Kardashians had the internet divided once again. But this time, it was for a reason nobody would have expected. And no, it wasn't about some dress or a surprise wedding. Turns out, it was because Courtney shared a bunch of pictures, which included a bathroom snap featuring plates of food across the floor. Yep, you heard that right, actual food, people. I mean, there was even a half-eaten burger resting on the toilet. It didn't come as much of a surprise that everyone's first reaction was, ooh, that's disgusting. The photo ended up sparking a huge debate on the internet about hygiene. It got to a point where there were more than 5,000 comments under the post. Still, some fans were quick to defend their favorite idol. One user pointed out the valid argument that people often take their phones to the bathroom and then put it next to their food. Courtney then responded to the backlash in the most iconic way. She reposted the photo on her Instagram story and captioned it, the comments about this photo, along with a series of dazed emojis with swirly eyes. Then, the reality star revealed that the picture was actually a behind-the-scenes shot of a recent photo shoot with her husband, Travis Barker. So I guess Court doesn't really like to have her meals in the washroom after all, thankfully. But you know what else this reminded me of? The time Chloe put a hater in their place. Everyone knows that Chloe is no stranger to hate, whether it's getting criticized about getting back with her cheating ex or about her ever-changing face structure. She's dealt with it all. But let me tell you guys about the time she had enough with all the negativity coming her way. It all started when she shared a video of her intense workout routine in her home gym. She talked about how she lacked the motivation to work out but she still showed up. And in true Kardashian manner, she had put a filter on her face. The video even featured her daughter, True Thompson. A troll then decided to call her out and leave a pretty rude comment. The person wrote, do you miss your old face? To which Chloe replied very simply with a big fat no. The fans absolutely loved her reply. One social media user even expressed how people need to mind their own business. I mean, when people are constantly commenting on your looks and always accusing you of altering your face, it can make a person lose their cool. But not Chloe. She's now decided to rise above the hate. It's safe to say that she isn't losing any sleep over how others feel about her. Her reply officially confirmed her position as the comeback queen. But Chloe isn't the only Car Jenner who's a pro at savage comebacks. Kim has been clapping back at annoying fans for years. Let me be honest with you guys. If I was to list the amount of times that Kim has been mommy shamed by haters, it would pretty much take up all the time in this video. Thank you. I guess it's like not official until you post. You what? It's official. I guess it's not official until, until you, you post. post. It's not real. Instagram. Yeah. Yeah. But the queen of social media has learned to shut her haters up with the right amount of savageness. For instance, let's look at the time she posted an adorable series of family Christmas photos. And mommy shamers were quick to point out her daughter North's bright red lipstick. Kim immediately replied saying that North picked it out herself. And that's not all. The Kardashian even turned it into a mini lipstick promo, saying the lipstick would be available for purchase soon. That's some unique marketing. What's more is that when North was six months old, Kim shared an absolutely adorable picture of her when she was smiling. After posting the picture, her haters accused her of having her baby's eyebrows waxed. Kim then replied back jokingly by saying that she'd at least wait till North is two years old to do that. She then once again tweeted that she was only joking and that her daughter was naturally blessed with thick, nice eyebrows. Then there's Kylie Jenner, who absolutely refuses to let body shamers bring her down. Just like her sisters, Kylie's no stranger to getting hate online. Back in 2020, a fan account decided to post a throwback video of Jenner from April 2017, where she was posing with fans at the opening of the Sugar Factory American Brasserie. The comments under the post straight up body shamed the reality TV star. One user wrote about how she looked much better back then, while another pointed out how skinny she was. Well, Kylie immediately knew she wasn't going to let them get away with it. She decided to join the comment section with the most iconic comeback. Jenner wrote back by saying she had birthed a baby, and the fans absolutely loved it. Look amazing. Look I'm insane. still wanting your belly button is back to normal. Me too. 
people applauded her for shutting down criticism about her body, especially all the moms. The mother of two has been pretty much open about the changes her body has gone through ever since she gave birth. KJ even talked about how she had to overcome so many insecurities about her body. Plus, it's the 21st century, folks. It's time we stop body shaming others, even if they're celebs. Still, one thing's for sure. The haters learned that day that you don't mess with Kylie when it comes to her body. Next up is a hater moment that pissed Kim off so much she dropped the F-bomb multiple times. It all started when Kim was showing off her new makeup products on her hand instead of her face on Snapchat. Nothing wrong with that. People swatch products on their arms or hands all the time. Just look at Kylie. It's exactly how she created buzz about her lip kits. But some fans clearly didn't like that and decided to call her out on it. One user criticized her by saying that the products were meant to be used on people's face, so she should apply them there instead, while others made fun of her swatching technique. Well, Kim was clearly having a really bad day, cause guess what she decided to do? Yep, she went on a very long rant and responded to all the hate. Kim showed the fans the pimple on her face, which explained why she wasn't using the products on her face. Kim then started dropping so many F-bombs. She told everyone how they were stressing her out so much. That's not all. After that, she sarcastically replied that she doesn't know how to swatch powders yet, and that she's in a learning process. Cold-blooded killer. But taking the cake is Chloe, and the time she snapped at a hater who couldn't spell. Now, this happened back when Kylie and Jordan Woods were still best friends, and Jenner used to post pictures of them together all the time. Yep, it's that old. Anyways, Kylie posted a pretty cool mirror selfie on Instagram that featured Jordan too. And of course, the haters couldn't stop themselves. When Chloe posted a very loving comment on the picture, a hater then decided to diss both Chloe and her sisters. That too, in a comment that was full of grammatical mistakes. I'm getting secondhand embarrassment just talking about it, guys. The social media user wrote about how the Kardashians need to get over themselves, since all they've done is quote, bide their looks. Coco was quick to spot the spelling mistake and hilariously fired back by saying that the word would be bought. I've said it before, and I'll say it again, guys. Chloe is a queen. Nobody defends the family as much as she does, and people can't help but appreciate her loyalty. So, if there's one thing we've all learned from this video, it's that you should think twice before criticizing the Kardashian clan, at least publicly. We've been there before and we'll always be okay. We're always family. That's how we were raised. Um, but I, I'm also proud that everyone's really vulnerable because I'm sure so many other families have gone through similar things, maybe on different levels. Well, there you have it. Those were the times the Kardashians clapped back at fans.